The following video was shot in January 2019, before the coronavirus pandemic, which is why you'll see clips like this. Please continue to adhere to government guidelines on social distancing. It was also filmed before we knew what wind was, and as a result, some of the audio is a bit ropey. We've put in subtitles where we feel it's necessary and try to clean it up the best we can. So, sorry about that. And enjoy. This is Harris Williamson, host of critically acclaimed web series Things with Harris. He once unicycled 96 miles along the West Highland Way. This is John McQueen, host of the critically panned web series Yelling at Clouds. John has never been on a unicycle before. This is Talent Trade. Good girl. They were ridden a unicycle. Yes? No. Oh, that's why you're ridden a bike. Yes. Right? Very good. Stay on a bike. Yeah, I'm not falling off a bike. Good. So, I'm going to start you off getting on the unicycle. Yeah, I'm going to get you walking back and forth. Part is probably going to be getting used to the direct drive. So, the bike you've got chains and gears and stuff. This, when you pedal forwards, it moves the same pace as the wheel, and when you pedal backwards, it moves the same pace as the wheel. It's completely connected to the wheel. Okay. So what, what's, what's the point? Why, why that's over a bike? Uh. Uh. Go home! Uh, I'll uh, see you guys later! Uh, um, challenge. And you you look really cool? No. Oh, try again. You'll look but you could be fine. You'll be fine. Fab looking bit of a 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 Well, the wiki now guy facing. Step one. You're gonna get to all the human side. It sounds easy. But not. Step two, you're going to get your feet rough and back and forth. And I mean back and forth. Half revolution the way. Some would call it a full revolution. Step three, we're going to get you moving forward. We're going to get you off. You're going to leave the hole. You're going to go for it. Falls the wall. We're going to see how far we can get you. If we get to the right point, we're going to get you over the court. Seems like exercise. So yeah, yeah. Okay, John. First thing you want to do is you said your right hand. Yeah, right hand. Is it on the right hand? You want to also pull. Um. Hello. So make sure you've got the your dominant foot, which is your right foot. And it's the right pedals on the bottom. It's on the bottom. Yep. Right. And then you want to put it between your legs. I see. Hello. Yep, and then put your foot on this pedal here. It doesn't seem to want to. It, it will. It doesn't want to go up. Right. And then. Can you show me, can you show me this one? Just, yeah. So you're going to do it here. Between your legs. Very far. Okay. Yep. And then you're, you're going to fully go up and go back. Look at bastards. <laughs> <laughs> you're on. And then, ladies and gentlemen, this is when you show the, I show you my um, true talent to being a unicyclist. We want to step onto that and then rock back into this. <laughs> right over my team. <laughs> one wheel, two legs, one of it. Just walk those needles. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we don't want to push yourself so far forward. You want to try and keep on top of the, so keep your centre of gravity above the uh, You're getting better tips. Don't fall over. No, that's about it. Just get your nest over there, nice. That's 
that's it. Just go back up the top and back up. This went on for some time, but eventually John managed to get onto the unicycle. Right back. Right back. You've got it, you've got it, yes! Yes, 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 okay. This is only 1% okay. of my power! <gasps> okay, yeah, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. So now we want to do just kind of get the feeling of just going back, just a little, little, that's it, that's it, that's it. And just keeping your body all the way above. Stay on. I can't. It's too much for me. There you go. I'm never getting done. <laughs> that's it, that's it, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Having mastered getting on to the unicycle, we decided it was time for John to move on. He's, you've got on the unicycle, John. Yeah, yeah you've got to ride it. There's so not another step in between. That's when we go for a cup of coffee. But nah, get on it. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> That's it, that's it, that's it. Still strong. Get back. Bring it back now, y'all. Two hops this time. Hey! <laughs> 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 Make sure you, you got a wobble. Fuck it, fuck, fuck it, hell! <laughs> 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 no, you just do it. You just. Show him, Harris. So, you, so you're here. Come on, here. Yeah. Right, you're here. And you're. <laughs> can you probably make a point when you stood? So, you, so you're going to have to finish your unit ball. Um, I would have got to adjust. Oh, fuck. <laughs> 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 you fuck. <laughs> He's not even that good at this. Uh, the I'll go for it. Oh, <laughs> oh <fuck. laughs> I heard that pop. <laughs> Bye, kids. <laughs> we'll be right back after these messages. Hi, I'm John, and welcome to my advert for the, the, the ball breaking unicycle. Um, Break your balls every time, guaranteed. <laughs> I had to wear, I wore four pairs of cycling tracks and half a tub of Vaseline a day. Half a tub of Vaseline a day? Say that again. <laughs> Don't have a one, two, Jane. <laughs> Don't see another way you can do it. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> so, you know anything about the history of the unit circle? Um, no, actually. I imagine it came from a performance side of things, like circus and stuff. And, like you said, there is no practical use to it whatsoever. Ah, oh, so you admit it? Yeah, well, I think it was pretty obvious, John. Why are you doing this? <laughs> keep that phone up the other side I've taught him all I can, he's just got to do it. That's... <laughs> you should not watch signs to it. <laughs> Bit calm. You just gotta get used to the feeling of <clears throat> like keeping your core body weight above the wheel. You gotta use, you gotta kind of just be relaxed yet also tense. Oh, I'm a foot slut. <laughs> You're ready, John. You're ready for the concrete. <laughs> oh fuck! He's taking his fucking unicycle. Oh, unicycle. <laughs> Just ran into someone. <laughs> 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 ran into the bin man. Did the bin man give you a row? Hey? Did the bin man give you a row? Maybe they take it. <laughs> <laughs> See when you get on the concrete and you are going right into the wall and you don't know why. It's because you're applying pressure. If I just put my weight on here and apply the pressure here, then I'm going to want to do that. But you've got to use your core and keep your body above it. Why am I doing it? I don't know. 
Yeah, you can not? be like me, John. Alright, <laughs> 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 you want your weight on. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Holy shit, I'm doing it. Yeah, that's it. He's fucking doing it. You're doing it, mate. <laughs> We got a friendly shout from over there. You're doing it, mate. I come around the corner. Come in the corner. I'm gonna try. Go, go. Come in the corner. Oh, again. It's not really much of a teacher, more of like a. I don't know what he is. Bro, no, one, no one taught me. You gotta learn yourself. You gotta do it. Oh, now you're saying no one taught him now. Oh, that's short of it. So short. At first, John struggled, but after several hours, he managed to make it to the end. He just got to the fucking end. Did it. But can he do it without the bar? Right, John. Let's do this. Look, I'm up here now. I can't even move. Now's your chance. You're up. You're right. Ride or die. It was ride or die. And John chose die. Oh, did he? Did he? Look, look at me in the pips. Let's go. Right, Finley, let's go. Just leave. Alright. Jeez. I could get a taxi, please. After some convincing, John and the unicycle were reunited for a final attempt. Right, that's us. Got the footage. Oh, no, we're there. Alright, we've got the footage, right? No, right, I'm sure you don't have enough because I can get back on it. Right, Sorry, I almost did it there. No, you can understand it, I won't go to the pub as so much as next time, but I, I want to wanna finish the job. It's alright, don't worry, we'll, we'll sort it in post. It's fine. Well, you sure you're giving a footage? Aye, alright. Got plenty. You're gonna make me look good, are you? I'm gonna look cool. I need a second. I've got. I've got an idea. Having finally mastered the art of the single wheel, John took the opportunity to show us some of the unicycle tricks he'd managed to learn from Harris, while conveniently slightly out of focus. No! Uh, stay, in, stay in drugs, kids. Oh, a jumper back. <laughs> Once we got out of the wind, we took the opportunity to sit down with John and Harris and find out what they thought about their experience. How was that, John? Do you think you've learned something? I mean, I have learned something, whether it's useful in my day to day life or not, that's. Uh... But you've learned something. 
You disgust me. Yeah. Honestly. Pointless. It's like You never know. Imagine you're going for a job somewhere. You're going for an acting job. And they're like, can you ride a unicycle? And I'll still say like, no because I fucking failed that. I settled, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, but it's like you're lying less. If you lie. I think that's a very good reason for any unicycle. Really? Or I could cycle 94 miles on the west side and wait at 96. Cut! Can somebody get this guy away from me? I'm gonna hurt him. So, um, what did you think of the overall unicycle teaching experience, John? Um, not much teaching happened, I'll be honest with you. Uh, he said, get on it and go. Uh, I wouldn't call that teaching. Well, I think what Harris was trying to say is that it, it's there's only so much he can teach you. It's, it's more just kind of getting like, used to it. If you if you'd never ridden a bike, then I'd be like, you know, you gotta know how to use pedals and how to like have wheel rolls and stuff. But if you've ridden a bike, it's just like riding a bike with one wheel. You just gotta do it. See what I mean? Uh, well, it's like he's just a really bad teacher, isn't it? Well, we saw you done a pretty good job there, uh, actually. So, are you are you gonna well, pick I up think a? If, if we look at it from that perspective, I mean, I basically taught myself how to do it, you know. So that well, makes so that makes that. Shut the fuck up, okay? You did nothing, Harris. You did nothing. You just stood there and did tricks around me. That's what you did. It's still something. I'm the teacher here. Taught myself. Are you saying that you're a self-taught unicyclist now? Basically, I'm sure. But self taught. Harris, how was John to teach? John was pretty good. He's pretty enthusiastic. He just. I told him to do it and he gave it a shot. And that's sort of it. You just gotta practice. That's. And you did it. So. Well done. Would you encourage John to pick up a unicycle again anytime soon? See you, you know, it's like a, you just get a really small one, though. like a really small wheel. Link, uh, how's, how small? I'm thinking like 16 inch, so just like this big wheel, little wheel. And you go <laughs> all the way to uni every morning. I don't want to hurt the unicycle, Harris. The unicycle wants to hurt you, John. God, would you guys like to see each other again? Do you, do you want to go first? Or do you go? No, no, I'm please do. You go first. Should do it at the same time. Yeah. Three, two, no. No. Do I have to stay here any longer? Is, uh, is that well, we've got a lot of forms for you to fill out. Me. Like, I don't, I don't want to be near him. He touched me. I didn't touch him. I physically do not want to be near the boy. Honestly. I'll fight you. Say that one more time, I'm going to hurt you. He touched me! <laughs> hey!